Yeah, so I think this image complete right here just exemplifies how we all feel <laughs> with the news we just got. So yeah, here's the uh, article. So here's what it says. So the film takes place between the events of Sonic 2 and Sonic 3, which is slated to hit theaters, of course, on December 20th, 2024. And the synopsis says, in the series, Knuckles agrees to train Wade as his protege and teach him the ways of an echidna warrior. Wow. So if you need a reminder, this is Wade right here. It, Wade is the other cop that works alongside Tom in Green Hill, which is, he's pretty, I'd say he's like, yeah, he's like the stand-in for when um, Tom is not around in Green Hill and he has to just watch over the town. He's pretty much, yeah, that's pretty much what he is. This is the stand-in guy who is also like a bit of a partier as well. Like, look at him, he's having the time of his life, right? And the scooter, got the... Siren helmet. What do you call those anyway? Is it just like a siren helmet? Because I remember watching Ned's The Classify and there was like that one vice principal that would just wear that around. It was one of the funniest things yet. <laughs> Here's the important thing. So production on the series is now underway and it's set and it's underway over at London. John Winnington, who worked on the screenplay for it, um, wrote, he wrote the plot and... We also got James Modestia as a writer, and Jeff Fowler will be reprising as director, so that is good to hear, so, <clears throat> sorry about that. Um, since they're working on it now, I'd say the best time to say we might see it will probably be, I think the best bet will maybe more than likely be, I'd say summer. I'd say more than likely summer, like somewhere of next year, like I'd say before December or like sometime before winter starts in November, so that way they can like pave the way to build up for Sonic 3, so because I think they're gonna at least like do, um, advertise it in a similar way to how No Way Home was where they start putting out trailers like I'd say in like September-ish or like August, but we'll also have like the other series around so they can at least have time to focus on like both of them while those two medias are being sent out to people. But yeah, back to what they're talking about with the synopsis. So here, here's what I'm thinking because like with how that sounds, you, you I probably expected like some sort of like journey or treasure hunting with like knuckles for him like maybe some like backstory for like the echidnas maybe at least some chaos that's what i was hoping for that was what i'm hoping for the most just seeing the chaotic i needed to see them more than anything else and i'm hope and i'm hoping that happens but i'm guessing and i feel like they're gonna do this for maybe more of the other characters is they're going to like do that bond between what this one human and then the other character with the one of the Sonic characters and just have them bond over the course because I think that's what they're gonna try to recreate similar to how they did with Sonic and Tom in the first movie I feel like that's how it's gonna go for most of the movie so pretty much Wade's going to be learn learning how to be tougher and I'd say assertive thanks to Knuckles and I'd say Maybe Knuckles learns to be, I'd say, either either more open about how he feels, or I'd say learn how to rely on others. I'd say one of those two for his character growth in that series. That's what I'd say would happen. The villain though for the movie or for the series, I am curious about, because what is gonna bring these two to work together over the course of the series, because remember, because again, Eggman's presumed to be dead, and we don't know what's happening with Jim Carrey. And I, I'm guessing Agent Stone is definitely going to be saved for three as well. I don't, I don't think he's going to be focused on Knuckles. So I really, I'm guessing. I, I'm, I feel like they will try. I feel like maybe. 
Rouge will be the, uh, will, like be the main villain for it. I'd say either Rouge or hmm, maybe I gotta think. It's really hard to say who could this be the person they fight for the series because like it's either I'd say Rouge or maybe like a prototype machine that Eggman had over. Because maybe this is how they like finally start to introduce like the Metal Sonics. Because maybe they could just fight like a prototype Metal Sonic or what, what, what was it called? It was like there's like there's the Silver Sonic, the Mecha Sonic, and then maybe and the Metal Sonic. But I feel like Metal Sonic will be saved for another time. But what was there was like another one. This was cool to see though. If, if you this I I love that they are doing this now. So they are starting to include the hat way more in the series now because if you remember this hat this was what knuckles had in the ova for for when he shows up yeah. i just love the, the way it's designed because i like the three stars on it they they just brought it back funny enough it was just brought back in the murder of sonic the hedgehog so i'm glad that they are now bringing this hat back and i am hoping they do include more stuff like that because I I definitely want to see more more like more music of course because I this is where <laughs> this is what I the result of Mario movie now I need to see more music be utilized I there shouldn't be any reason at all why it shouldn't happen so I it might be hard but I at least want to hear some of his tracks because remember he has so many good tracks to hear from because you got unknown for me. You got Wild Canyon, you got Pumpkin Hill, you just have like so much of a variety that I want to hear um, be utilized with Knuckles, and I'm really hoping they pull that off. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, quick discussion. It's been a while since I've had any Sonic topics be brought up. I haven't had really much to cover. I only like to cover like a few certain things, but I, mean, I am glad to hear that there are that the movies and series is back on track and i'm hoping there i think we might get prime news soon but we are getting the origins dlc in june so we'll get that soon as well as the uh i think we'll also get season two of prime in i say i think it might be another summer i think it might be summer it is our best bet but Thank y'all for watching. Uh, be sure to sub and tune in more for streams later at night. I should be able to stream later tonight. So thank y'all for tuning in. And I shall see y'all later on. See ya.